For the last year, Gavin Roberts has had one birthday wish in mind. He was always saying, uh, well, it's the vaccine. We're going to get that. So this Sunday, on his 12th birthday, a nurse granting him that wish. He was finally old enough to get his first dose of the COVID-19 vaccine. She gave me the dose and we waited 15 minutes after to see if I had any reaction. Then she gave me my vaccine card. What came after was a painful side effect of longing. That piece of paper, a reminder of just how cruel the virus could be. Last year, COVID-19 took his father's life, police officer Charles Rob Roberts. I think it was April 21st, he collapsed, and then on May 11th, we let him go. Officer Roberts was just 45 years old. His wife says he was healthy when he was taken down by COVID. He took the virus very seriously, but because other people all didn't and there wasn't vaccinations then and there wasn't great testing, um, I mean, he never had the opportunity to get the vaccine. Alice Roberts, an elementary school teacher, was left with three children to raise on her own. Throughout this whole experience, we've felt that if we can turn a really sad, horrible moment in our lives into something that can help people, we want to do that. We see the only way out of this pandemic is to get as many people vaccinated as possible. A birthday wish, and now the public learning this family story, they hope will help save lives. By seeing us, um, hopefully it personalizes it for people and it's a real thing and it really happened to us. We're not paid actors, it really happened. Um, and it can happen to anyone. I hope that people just learn that it's very hard to go through and I hope no one else, well, I know some people are gonna experience, but I hope a lot of people don't experience this. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.